You know? Keep that in mind. I know. Yes. Well, it might still officially be winter, but if you're a parent of young kids, you're already thinking about summer. Summer camp we're talking about. And today we're going wild for camps at Rescue Ranch, a place where you can get up close and personal with all kinds of wild animals. Welcome EJ Zorbis and a few animal ambassadors mm -hmm. to the Charlotte today, and we got some lovely ones today. Hello, how you doing? Good, how are you? Yeah, Great, indeed. EJ, good to see you. <laughs> oh, yes. Uh, for, uh, well, can you tell us who's on your shoulder there <laughs> this morning? Yes. This is Miss Velvet. Oh, Miss Velvet, she's sweet, and she's just going to stay right there, right? Yeah, she'll just snuggle all day long if she'll, we let her. She'll just hang out and snuggle. All right, tell us about all the animals that you brought today. Certainly. Well, Miss Velvet is a Solomon Island Eclectus parrot, so not one of your more common ones. Mm -hmm. she's day yes. For heart month. She so, likes your earrings. I think she wants those for Valentine's she likes Day. shiny things. So, yeah, she is inclined to try and nibble on those. Um, she will live approximately 50 years. So it's really? So it's to consider. Wow. When you're taking in a pet, is their lifespan, and if you can accommodate that. That's true. Birds can live a really long time. Yes. Mm -hmm. So she she just turned 11 last month, oh. so she's doing really well. She um she was rescued from a hoarding situation. Oh. And so she's come a long way with us, but now she really enjoys getting out and meeting all sorts of different people. Okay. So with that hoarding situation, quickly, the, the birds like to be separate by themselves, or like um, to be with There's approximately thing? 30 to 40 in that situation, so that's far too many. Too in many birds. Household. Um, definitely. It, it, Unlike an aviary and a zoo, you mm -hmm. gotcha. have at least that many. All right, birds. who else? Who else do you have, EJ? Well, they said you needed to kiss somebody, but you could <laughs> kiss some bunny. Oh, you're good. Look at these big old oh. feet. So this is Hershey. Hi, oh, Hershey. Wow. Hershey for the day. Um, Hershey is a lionhead rabbit, and he is a very sweet. He's got some really cool hair going on. They are a created breed, so you should never see these in the wild. Oh, really? They were created in Belgium in the 1950s. And um, they were only brought over to North America, really, the early 2000s. Oh, your turtles okay, yeah, don't, don't have your Here, turtles you fall out. Okay, okay, yeah. Okay, it's okay. <laughs> it's okay. So, well, yeah. my brother hit me. Okay. <laughs> well, apparently, Mr. Apple would like some attention. Yeah. So, okay. Oh, gosh. Okay. So, I didn't want him to fall off the table. Wow. Hi, Apple. He is a sulcated tortoise. He is only four years old. Um, and he could grow up to 150 pounds. We have a 30-year-old one at the ranch. And he is quite big. He's larger than this. He's larger than the thing. Table. He's 150 pounds, and it takes at least two of us to, to move him. So he's just a baby. They both came to us from a sanctuary. Um, Can I hold Mr. 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 Turtle Hat? All right, go ahead, Lee. I, 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 there we go, Lee. What, what about the legs? What's going on with this like, like armor thing going well, on? Well, he's moving. Um, he's actually quite ticklish under his back legs, so if he's on the ground, we can get him moving even faster. Okay. Um, but all these critters are, are some of the critters that the kids will interact with and help care for during critter camp. Can you talk more about critter camp Absolutely. and what it is and all that good stuff? So it's an educational um, day camp that we started in 2014. Uh, we offer day camps throughout the summer. There's preschool camps, which are a half-day camp. Um, we also do kindergarten through um, fifth grade and then middle school camps. And new for this year, we've added um, a camp for children with disabilities. Oh, that's really yeah. great. Yes, yeah, mm -hmm. smaller ratio, smaller numbers. So it'll be a one to three ratio of teachers to students. And they'll also get to interact with all of our animals, um, potentially help care for them. Um, and just learn all sorts of different things about their wonderful lives. And what's your mission, though? What's the mission of your Our course? mission is to educate um, through hands-on education programs hey. and to enhance people's experiences with animals, um, to promote agriculture, wildlife, um, and just that human-animal bond. And you really do rescue a lot of animals, don't you, and we give them a over, new lease on life. We have over 87 animals currently residing with us. Mm. All the animals that live with us currently are permanently adopted by us to be used in our education programs. Um, so they will live out their lives with us. Um, and we've just celebrated our third anniversary, so we'll continue to develop. We actually have a new development launching in April. Construction begins on our 10,000 square foot inclusive playground. Tell us more about the playground. Mm. So the playground is a really exciting initiative hey. for us. You're just going to snuggle. Yeah, what's up? Um, it's A playground was always an important piece because we target children. And so there's always another piece of education that we can help them understand. And so if we were going to build one, we didn't want to build one that everybody couldn't play on. And so it'll be an opportunity. It doesn't matter if they're in a That's awesome. That's really awesome. I, congratulations to you on all the work that you're doing. Do you also have a, a camp for spring break? I believe you do, right? We have a spring break staycation. Okay. So a day camp. Um, we have daily options and then a week-long option. So if you're just looking for something for your child for one day during that week, 
um, then we have that for you. He's or cool. He is very cool. He's really cool. Yeah. Very good. So if your kids would like to get up close and personal with all these critters and so much more, go to Rescue Ranch. You can sign up for those camps at rescueranch.com, rescueranch.com. But now is the time to get registered for yes. summer camp and that spring break day camp, too. Absolutely. Okay. Thank you so much. They're so cute. I don't go too far, though. I want Beautiful to animals, I know. All right. Well, coming up on Charlotte today this morning, meet the former microbiologist who used science to make sure your food order gets to your house hot and fresh. And plus, we're talking about how you can instill joy into your child's life and why that's such an important thing to do.